And someone will ask, why are we learning about the law? I'm very sure that it's not everyone here that wants to be a lawyer. You don't have to be. Why are we learning about the law? Why should we know um, basic information about the law? Do you know why? Because ignorance is say, and that's actually true, it's not that it's it's very dangerous to be in a place, to be in a country, to be in a situation. Just like in this school now, I know that there are lords that go on your studentship, right? You come to school by so and so time, you have your break time by so and so time, you um, you have examination, you have rules, you have uniforms that you wear, and different rules that come on organizations. That's just how it is. That is a real nation. It's a rule of body of rules made by institutions. What is and persons vested with authority to make such rules? So what makes it law is that it's, it is made by the persons or institutions or bodies that have been vested as they have the authority to make such rules. For example, now um, your your brother has home or your sister at home cannot come, and then a regular to tell you what to do. You won't listen to him, right? If he comes and tells you, okay, um, you are going to be coming to school by 6 o'clock, 6 a.m. Would you listen to him? Why? Right. Exactly. He's not the person to make the rule. He has no authority to make the rule. Just, that's just how laws are. Okay? So, um, they are, they are binding. It's binding on the members of the given state or society. And then, without laws, there will be anarchy. You know what anarchy means? Lawlessness. Imagine where, where um, nothing regulates you. Someone can just come and take your pain because the person wants to. But now, we have laws that if you, if you take someone's um, um, stuff without the person's permission, <coughs> you have the intention to permanently deprive that person of ownership of that pain. That's silly. Now, that's a law. If you're someone that just come and take your property, take your land, take your bring you, that's you know, and nothing, and the person goes to touch free. Someone can just come and be that's not beat you up, and the person goes to touch free. But no, we have laws that regulate this things. If not, there will be lawlessness in the society. Okay? Then, it's important to have basic knowledge of the law, irrespective of whether you are a lawyer or not. Like I said, ignorance of the law is not an excuse and it will help you avoid trust. So let's let's look at some little little facts about the law. The first one is that it's a body of rules and it cannot be found in a single book. Now so you cannot say the whole laws of Nigeria is not contained in one book. Yes, we have the constitution. I mean I was not about the constitution of Nigeria. That's good. Now, all the laws are not contained in that constitution. We have other different laws. We have something like criminal code, we have penal code, we have uh, laws of different. There are different books. Of, so, the point is that all the laws are not contained in one book. So that nobody can deceive you when you go outside. Everything is in one book. Okay? Then the next one is that laws are not made. It is adopted by the society to govern itself. Therefore, we as citizens have responsibility to determine the laws that govern us. So they are man-made. The laws are made by humans in the society, just like here in our school. The laws are made by the authorities here in school. It's not spirits that make laws. Okay? Then, another thing about the law is that it's limited in school. It has a defined set of people it applies to. Like, when I was driving, to this place. I saw so many schools. There are so many schools around this area. Now, the laws that govern Graceland is not the one that governs there is one that is very, very close to this area. Yeah, all laws are different. Their uniforms are even different. So someone cannot come. The principal of um, that one cannot come to Brightland and tell you what to do. She or he. So, laws are defined.
Law and School Program at Brightland International Academy.